welcome to my Q&A for April. Siobhan writes, how do you stay disciplined when you are your own boss? I find myself getting distracted and keep bumping my task list. So what's your top tips to get stuff done? Well, Siobhan, it's easy, dear. Um, it's all about personal discipline, especially the discipline to just finish that task list. I wrote this blog, for example, 8 p.m. last night. There's no deadline other than my own, and I you know, was feeling a bit bleary after the weekend, and I could have let it go for a day, do it tomorrow, and just drop it off the day's task list. But I don't, because one of my commitments to myself is to personally land everything on my task list that I set for myself that day, because it really does matter. It matters if you just leave one thing or don't do one of your tasks that you set out to do. Why? It's not just letting the task slide, it's the psychological precedent that gets you into the mindset that it's okay to let things slide. So after that, what else do you let pass? Your deadlines, your time scales, you start compromising on everything. It's all about getting into the psychological pattern of doing what you say you're going to. Not just to other people, we all do that, right? Oh, you do, don't you? Oh, please don't tell me you're one of those people who overpromises and underdelivers. Do you know how rare it is in business today just to do what you say you're going to do? Pretty rare. So therefore, it's very easy to differentiate yourself from your competition by just doing what you say. But when I say do what you say you're going to do, that means on time, within deadline, on budget, and to 100% satisfaction of your client or supplier or team member who's relying on the output. I know the task lists are infinite. Um, so they're key tasks that they must do, not projects that don't really matter. There's a key caveat here, which is only to set a few things to do in a day that take core time, you know, that three, four hours concentrated working, a maximum of five to ensure they're done. And always add a thing or two of yourself for yourself so that you feel kind of balanced of work versus you time. But whatever you do, and whenever you do it, you must, must, must finish your commitments every day. You must finish your task list, deliver stuff on time, and make your personal deadline as important as external deadlines to get that routine of that 100% commitment to completing and finishing. So Siobhan, it's time to go for it. Get that task list done every day. Get yourself 100% into that completing, finishing mindset and then you'll see some real progress happening. Hope that helps, bye for now.